we're on page 30 um, and we're going to go through these questions well, I'm not actually going to go through this particular explain section previously but what we're doing is we're writing functions or equations for the functions that include um, a certain number of points and, and we're basing this off of um, we're basing this off of the uh, exponential function equation which can be written as f of x equals a b to the power of x and uh, the next questions will help us figure out well how to write this so in question one we have these two points one comma six and two comma twelve and so the first thing we're going to do is find b which is this number here and the way we do it is we're going to divide the second term from the first term kind of like uh, finding the common ratio but in this case um, uh, I shouldn't even say term right it's a function of one and the function of two so we're, we're going to divide the function of two divided by the function of one and so let's go ahead and, and do that the function of one you come out with six the function of two you come out with twelve where did I get those well the function of one here the function of six is right there and so let's divide the function of twelve which is twelve or sorry the function of two which is twelve by the function of one which is six so b turns out to be two and then we're going to solve for a by using this function uh, f of x equals a b x so um, we're going to choose uh, whichever points we choose we're going to get the same answer and so I think that's why they have us go through this twice so we're going to if we choose 1 comma 6 which is the first which is the first one up here um, x equals 1 f of x equals 6 and so uh, we need to figure out what um, or sorry we already found out what b is b is 2 we found it out up here um, and so if we substitute everything we obtain uh, f of 1 is equal to a times b or not b in this case 2 because b equals 2 in this case to the power of x which is 1 okay so oh I forgot one thing not f of 1 f of x equals 6 equals a times 2 to the 1 so let's find out what a equals and uh, 2 to the power of 1 is just 2 so 2a divided by 2 divided by 2 so we get 3 equals a um, and if we do the other one we should also get 3 for a so if we use the other point 2 comma 12 the x value is 2 I don't know what I'm writing there 2 the f of x or the function of x uh, is right there at 12 and, and b again is 2 and so if we plug this in f of x is 12 equals a times 2 to the power of 2 so 12 equals 4 a divided by 4 3 equals a uh, and which is what we got for the other one I told you that you should come out with the same answer here for a so step 3 we can actually get to plugging in right we found out that a equals 3 and b equals uh, 2 and so if we write the exponential function f of x equals a which is 3 times b which is 2 to the power of x and this looks like 32 so let's be careful about putting the grouping symbols in the right way so 3 times 2 to the power of x okay uh, that was question or sorry that was page 30 let's get to page I think page 32 is is our next destination here yeah page 32 and um, we're gonna do more of the same let's solve for B <coughs> once again by dividing um, the, the function of 2 or sorry uh, taking the sequential ones in this case it's gonna be f of 3 which is 1 third divided by f of 2 which is 1 and so our b is going to equal 1 third since 1 third divided by 1 is just 1 third and we're gonna go ahead and plug in uh, these values to to get to figure out what a is I'm only gonna do one of these I'm just gonna go ahead in this one if you do the other one you should get come out with the same answer as well so again f of x equals a b to the power of x um, and let's just say that the f of x in this case is 1 equals a times the b which we found is one third to the power of 2 okay and where do we get the 2 we got it right here so uh, 1 equals a times 1 third squared which is 1 time 1 over 9 or sorry 1 over 3 times 1 over 3 which is 1 over 9 and 
When we multiply both sides by 9, we get 9 equals a. Let's solve for a. Uh, and then if we write the exponential function, the function of x equals a, which is 9, times um, times b, which was what? What did we found out b? It was one third. One third to the power of x. So there is our um, exponential function that contains the points 2 comma 1 and 3 comma 1 third.